No, I'm really nervous. Like, y'all. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it, y'all. YouTube, it's your girl Tia, and I'm back it again with another video. Mm, 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 mm. What's up? What y'all doing? What y'all doing? Uh, I guess I got a new bonnet, and it stayed on all night, and I don't know how to act. And it's so cute, y'all. It's like one of them silky satin ones, and it's got like little lace covering. Period, and it's extra long because you know I got them locks that booty okay so don't mind me um so yeah we got a little project going on today i do have to go to work in a few hours um oh if you are new to this channel make sure you like comment and subscribe we're doing something i've done before that i haven't done in a while so i wanted to film it and, um just see just see how it turns out so we are gonna be dying the brows dying the brows Yes, ma'am. And I also have stuff to do my lashes, individual lashes for the first time. But that might be a separate video. This is just going to be specifically about this. So this is the dye that I got. It is permanent dye. It's beard dye. Um, I got it in the color dark brown. Yeah, dark brown. So this is a new color or a new one. Um, this is cream of nature. It's natural looking, okay? Because my hair does look... It, sometimes it looks black, but it's really brown. Like, if you really know your black from your brown, it's really dark brown. So, yeah, this is natural looking. It says I only need it for five minutes. Um, and I don't want mine to look so dark. So, I don't think I'm going to um, leave it on that long. I want mine to... Ooh. I want mine to look natural. Um, so, yeah, um dark brown but this is the natural looking moisture rich hair color with shea butter conditioner so but this will last you a long time doing this trick you only need like a squeeze of the color so you can use this for a while so however long it lasts just once it fades just redo it you feel me so when i have done this before what i have done was outline it with um some type of vaseline or something like that I outlined it with Vaseline with a Q-tip, like this. But low-key, it was like a little greasy mess. So, what we're going to do is, I saw other girls do, is we're going to use concealer to outline, and then go in the middle with the dye. So, we're not going to make this too long. So, yeah, let's get started. Open up your box here. You're going to get the cream color developer. This is going to be the color, moisture rich hair color. Boom. So this is number two. This is number one. And then what else is in here? Instructions and then the conditioner stuff. So I'm pretty sure you mixed one and two. They didn't give me a little um, tab to put it in, so we might just rip a piece of box and use that. Um, they did give me gloves, which I don't think I'm going to need. So first, put on your gloves. Snip off the tip of number one. I need scissors, y'all, so hold on. And then pour all, not pour it all, I'm doing a little bit. Pour the colorant into the developer. Colors so, it says when I put it on, do not take more than three minutes to complete putting it on and leave it on for five minutes total. For darker coverage and blending, leave it on longer. Do not exceed 15 minutes. So, I don't want this to be super dark. So, 
I have to make sure that I'm not doing this too long. So, and I used, like, what I have done this before, I've done one and the other. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go do this end, go do this end, and then fill the middle, then do the middle, then do the front, then do the front. That's what I'm going to do. Three-part harmony. Okay. So, first things first, I kind of need something to hold the... Um, people usually use like a some type of bowl or something. I don't feel like going to get nothing, so I'm just gonna cup cup this up like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But anyways, so I'm gonna outline my brows. Just outline them as normal. Um, I'm gonna try to take some off of the bottom. As far as like those extra hairs and stuff. So hold on y'all. I think that's too much. I definitely think that's too much. But okay, so let me outline let me outline this first, y'all. Like I always do when I do my makeup. I got this new vanity oil and it's like motion sensor so I apologize the light keep cutting on and off but it does have great lighting can't can't say it out but anyways um yeah if y'all guys want to see my vanity or know where I got it from let me know in the comments anyways so yeah you just outline your brows like you would I don't carve the top of my brows normally. I just don't like how harsh that looks. I know people blend it out, whatever. I just still don't like how harsh that looks. But I gotta do it for this purpose. Oh my gosh, I haven't done the top in so long. <laughs> and it's so weird because I have like thick, thin eyebrows. Like I have a thick width of an eyebrow, but look how like thin it is. Like. You feel me like it's a little thing. I still think they're cute though. Hold on, let me not blend the line too much because I want to be able to see. Oh shit. Hold on, I need to. I'm blending it too much like I'm doing makeup. You be able to see the outline. <laughs> Cause now I'm not looking wild. Take a boom. All right, we're back, y'all. I had a little technical difficulty, <clears throat> but yeah, we're back. So I'm still outlining. Alright y'all, so that's the outline. We're gonna move on. Alright y'all, I'm back. I just cut the top off of the one. And I got the two. I'm just gonna put them here like I said. Just put about that much. And then we're gonna do equal parts. I wish this had a um squeeze too. This one was hard to pull. Let me squeeze some more out for the first one because I almost dropped it off. Okay. Hold on, let me shake this a little better. <laughs> I look crazy. Okay, look. So I'm going to pull bubbles. Ooh. Damn. I pulled too much. I pulled a little much, so let's pull. A little bit more the first one. Right now, that's what I'm looking like, y'all. 
there's so much color in all of my looking like I can see the white, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. I wish I had a spoon. I don't know. But yeah, I don't know. So let's do that real quick. It's orange. Okay. So this is where it was mixed up. I'm gonna wipe the excess off the brush and then go like that again. Oh, okay, y'all. Starting at the end. Yeah, the end of it. Can y'all see? Okay. The little light Africa. Look. What am I saying? That was a little thin layer. Can I do everything up like that? And the cream is starting to get darker. Remember how orange it looked? I can't cloak and, and concentrate and do this at the same time. I'm just going to have to watch. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Gotta make a point. I'm going to do a real thin layer. Now I'm gonna go in and add another. I don't know. It looks kind of good. Should I add another layer, or just see what this do? I'm gonna go in where I think it's gonna be light. So like on the ends, I'm gonna go back in in this little like corner. with your concealer and clean it up so it does not dye where you don't want it to. Oh, it kind of burns, y'all. kind of burns. Okay, I see it getting too dark right here. So I'm going to clean this up. Look how dark the dye is on the thing, y'all. So it looks fine. So I'm trying to like not have them look crazy. So, so I'm gonna wait five minutes and come back. It is time. Oh my god, I'm nervous. It's time to wipe this off. There was a spot where I seen like it was a little lighter, so I don't know. I might gotta go back in and make it darker, but we gonna see how it come out. We gonna see how it come out. I got a little wipey. Whew. 
Oh, I'm nervous. Okay, I gotta wipe these. We're gonna wipe this off. Okay. Pray for me, y'all. Pray for me. Oh, the reveal. Oh, I'm not gonna wipe this side off first. I'm gonna wipe this side off first because this is the side where I think it's gonna be a little light, like in this area. Who is from the beginning or the end? <laughs> no, I'm really nervous, like y'all. Okay, okay, let's do it. Let's do it, y'all. I'm nervous. And then the light. Oh. Okay. See, I really could have left it on for longer. Look at that, y'all. Like, did it work or not? Do y'all see a difference? I feel like I could have left it on for longer. And that was only like five minutes. Damn. I could have left it on for longer. So let me see the other side. Y'all, I don't see much of a difference. Y'all, nah, be. You know what it is? It literally just dyed my hairs. It didn't. It didn't. Um do the skin part like I thought it was going to but you know that's fine that's fine it still looks fire I just think it could have been like more crisp you know what I'm saying like it could have been more crisp it literally just dyed my hairs I think like look I think it just dyed my hairs cause look Y'all, here I was thinking I just finessed some shit. This is this is low key a fail, low key, because this is not the results I was expecting, babes. Y'all, should I just leave it like this or do another coat? If I do another coat, then that bitch gonna stay on there for like thirty minutes. I'm not really, not really that satisfied, y'all. Not really that satisfied. I should have left this shit on longer. Should I do another layer? Cause it's giving. Up. What is giving? It really didn't, like, it dyed my eyebrow hairs, but it didn't, like, dye the section. For real, for real. So, <laughs> I don't. It looks pretty much about the same. In my opinion. It looks a tad bit darker, but it looks the same. Y'all, yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna try to do another layer off camera because I gotta move on to my next video. So, yeah, y'all, this was the results. I don't even know why I was worried, like, it was about to be all black, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, this was just one coat.
So I'm going with a second coat while I still got some. And we're going to see.